Next, I'm going to discuss about the try and method of this program. So if you debug the code, control comes to main function here after that coincide. So right here, I have taken one integer variable i and uh, two char variable str1 and str2. str1 and next str2. So the size I have given uh, 12. Uh, for str1 and for str2 12. So at here you can enter maximum or 12 character. So at here enter the string. So whatever I'm going to enter so that received by str1. So at here I've given the size 12. So you have to enter maximum or 12 character. So I'm going to enter at here rayon or y a n so the total character is of 4 so let's uh, do indexing so r is in 0 position and 1 position y 2 position a and uh, 3 position n so raise to r till 11 that's r r is to null character So here after control comes to this point for i value start from 0 and uh, that check str1 of str0 position not equal to null. So 0 position r is there. So r not equal to null. The condition is true. So that uh, coincide. So at here str1 i value is not 0. So str0 position whatever the value is given. So that go to str2 of 0 position. So at here, initially, so at here, this is a 0 position, 1 position, 2, 3, and rest part is null, 4 till 11. So at here, str of 0 position value r and str2 of 0 position so that r go to str2 of 0 position so add here r stored to 0 position of str2 now here after that go up and increase the value of i so i become uh, 0 to 1 check the condition 1 so str1 position not equal to null so 1 position y is there y not equal to null the condition is true so that coincide so add here str i 1 position value go to str2 of 1 so str2 of 1 s to y so this value is y so y value go to there now that increase the value of i so i become 2 check the condition str2 of position not equal to null so 2 position a is there so a not equal to null the condition is true so str2 or position or value so two position value is a so a give to str2 of 2 so two position that is to a now here after i gonna increase by one so i become 3 now check the condition str3 position not equal to null so 3 position n is there so n not equal to null condition is true so str3 position value go to str2 of 3 so 3 position that is to n now here after i gonna increase by 1 so i become 3 to 4 and add here check the condition str1 of 4 uh, position not equal to null so 4 position this uh, 4 5 6 so this all value is null so add here 4 position value is also null at there so null not equal to null condition is not true so that going there str2 i value is now 4 so 4 position that is to null and here after control comes to this point so this uh, display into the output screen and the value of str2 so str2 value is r y a n uh, the display and here after that out from main function so this is the drive method of this program so i hope guys you understand so
Thanks for watching. See you next week.